Tell me I don't have to do this. Tell me that you'll stop. Tell me that you can't stop! I will never stop. So yeah, Sam and Dean get hurt a lot in the show, and someone may or may not like stabbing other cast members. Let it be said that you were on fire that episode because you also stabbed this guy. Yep. <laughs> you yep. probably cut two people in the history of Supernatural, and it was both that episode. Remember you stabbed me right in the knee? Um, That's what happens when you give a guy nine hours to shoot a fight scene. <laughs> You're like, listen, we're not going to do anything but fights and stunts today, and it's going to be yeah. all you. You have no stunt double. Go. Yeah. When, when, Don't when, hurt anybody. After Dean uh, and Kane fight, and he comes down with a giant, you know, that's not a knife, this is a knife kind of knife. Um, hey, to be fair, and... that was not my fault. I wasn't holding the knife. No, but you decided to knee it. I didn't knee it. Look, it was like this. This would be the knife. Yep, okay. So, as you're... I go, and then this would be Jared. As you're collapsing, I... I no. So he's supposed to collapse, but and I, do this. I, he was actually collapsing. I didn't. I didn't go like this. I didn't see the playback. The point is, you know, uh, Jensen's a, a, a large man and you can't. I'm saying that. Rotund. You can't. <laughs> Husky. If he's gonna actually fall down, I wasn't gonna pick him up like this. Because that's really bad. So I had to kind of like, really, I had to set my feet. And in setting and my I feet... I felt it, like I, I felt uh, and we're rolling. It's, go it's into his rehearsal. leg. So I kind of do this, and I feel like a ka -ching. I'm like, hmm. <laughs> use and I, it, use and it's, it. it's just in there. Like it's in there a good like half inch. Yeah. And, and it's, a re it's a real knife. This one, oh yeah, this, this, this was a real steel real, blade. Yeah. And I'm like, and I'm sitting there, and I'm still... And they haven't called cut yet, so he and I, I can tell he knows, he knows I know, I know he knows I know, he knows I know, he knows I know. <laughs> I'm like, is Everybody he, knows everything. Is he going to stop the scene? Because I'm pretty sure yeah. and so the then knife it's like, is in his leg. And then it's... And, and he didn't. He was just like, I think, I think I've been stabbed. <laughs> but I'm not sure you knew exactly. Yes, I... What? No. Yeah. It's not the first time today. You did it. Shane, you did it. All right. Well, because you didn't stop. And I was like, dude, there's a dart in your neck. I would. <laughs> That's... You know who does that? Crazy people. Too many darts. I didn't stop because I was like, okay, it's the end of the scene anyways. And they call cut, and I'm basically holding him up. I can feel that the blade is in my leg, like right above my knee. I'm like, yeah, that, okay. <laughs> and then they go cut, and immediately, Ackles just goes, dude, you all right? I felt that. And I look down, and my, the, there's already blood spreading on it's my pants. already pluming on his jeans, yeah. yeah. It had gone through my pants, through my skin. Luckily, my knee had stopped it. Um, <laughs> I think you call that your bone. Patellas. Better for things than just bending. <laughs> they can also stop knives. Uh, but yeah, you were two for two that episode. And I will that say... That was not my fault. That's your fault. I blame you. I'll say this. It's times like this that make me realize 
how awkward it must be for like the doctor convention on the other side of the hotel to walk past these doors. <laughs> We're all talking about stabbing each other, each other in the neck and the face. So I got him in the face and then I stabbed Jared in the leg. People are like, what are they talking about in there? <laughs> They're crazy. Someone's going, woo, when you're like, yeah, stab him in the neck. <laughs> uh, thank you for your question. Can I contradict you, however? You can try. I will. I'm oh, a then teacher. do it. I'll do that. Okay, that was not the same episode. Just was it not? not just saying. Oh, good, it wasn't. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. All right. <laughs> well, but thank you for the extra story. I, I, would I would say this then. If it had happened twice in a week, Mercury could have been in retrograde. But two different episodes, this boy's got a problem. <laughs> He's got a stabbing people problem. What was the other episode called? How many did Tim do? Jensen stabs people. <laughs> Hi there. Howdy. Um, I don't usually follow instructions people give me. I don't do what people tell me to do, but when Mark Shepard tells you to do something, you gotta do, do it. Do the opposite. <clears throat> right? Right? You do the opposite. <laughs> So this is for Jensen, and I don't know if anybody asked you in the gold panel, but for those of us who are poor and didn't go. <laughs> he said to ask Jensen about the time he almost lost his eye in the fight scene in Kane's kitchen. And we all like to hear about blood and gore and stunts. The time that I almost lost my eye? That's what he said. He said, you're fighting on the table there and you almost lost your eye. Oh. Said, With yeah, Tim. Yeah, no, no, no. Um, I, I think he, I think he makes, I, I almost took someone's eye out. Oh, well, then he was mistaken. He was slightly mistaken, uh, but not far, not far from mistaken because the person whose eye I almost took out is my stunt double, Todd. <laughs> So what had happened was, uh, and if you look at the, if you, if you watch the, the, the scene, um, Todd is the, uh, he's the, he's the actual demon that I'm fighting with up until the very end. And I, I kill him at the very end. So the fact that I was actually fighting the guy who normally doubles me meant that I didn't have a double that day. So I had to do, I had to do everything. So, because I was fighting, I was fighting my double. And then at the very end, there's that moment where, uh, where he's uh, slammed onto the, the to Kane's table there, and then I take the knife and drive it right through his neck. Um, luckily, the knife, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it was awesome. Luckily, the knife that I had was a the they call a rubber knife, but it was it's like very hard plastic um, and during the there was a lot of like fight choreography that we were going through during during the, the the fight just before the stab the tip of the blade had gotten bent like that so if it was like this and I didn't realize that so when I went to stab I, I was just gonna go just to the to the left of his face uh, but the tip had bent this way and so instead it caught him right right under the oh. eye it literally just opened him up because um, even though it's not a steel knife it's a it's a very hard pointed rubber tip and so it sliced him right open and um, I of course was like mortified Son of a something about you doing something for me right, right, right. <laughs> I'm still gonna keep talking and tell you a story. <laughs> and he just pops up, he's like, what? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I just, you've got a massive cut on your, on your eye. And he's like, oh, all right, uh, are we going again? <laughs> and he's just like holding his face together. He's like, we're going again? Uh, can we go again? Yeah, 
Todd, you're bleeding. <clears throat> eh, that's not that bad. Enjoy yourself. I've known Daniil, haven't I known her longer than you've known her, technically? <clears throat> oh, shut up. <laughs> no. Uh, you had, you already met? I met her many years ago. Yeah, we, we, yeah, we, Before, we knew each I, other. I, I've known her longer than I've known Jensen. Yes, um, that is true. So, uh, I know her as a friend, I know her as a mother, I know her as the wife to one of my best friends. Um, I know her as uh, Aunt, Aunt Eel, as my sons call her, because they can't. Uh, say Aunt Daniil as well as uh, we adults can. Um, I can't wait to work with her. I think it's really exciting. <clears throat> I think it's also, as a fan of the show, I'm excited for what it means. I'm excited for that little extra bit of, oh, this is going to be cool. Like, I know it's neat to have this backstory in this family where it's actually something that's uh, we look forward to. Like, how neat will it be to see them interact on camera and we've known them and we've loved them and supported them, them being uh, Ackles and Daniil. I say, that's funny. I'll see, I'll see Daniil every now and again and be like, hey, um, w when is Ackles going to go? And she's like, I'm an Ackles too. I'm like, oh yeah, right. <clears throat> When's Jensen? It just feels weird to say it. Um, I can't wait. I'm really excited. Um, I, I, I hope, I don't know what's going to happen, but I know that at some point in time, I'm going to have to explain to my children why Uncle Jensen and Daddy killed Mommy. <clears throat> So I'm hoping that we also have to explain to his children why <laughs> Uncle Jared and Aunt Mama killed Mom. So I'm, I'm awesome. You bitch. You're too late. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was one of the first things he said was, all right, dude, but promise me this, you've got to hold her while I stab her in the gut. <laughs> Thank you. All right, challenge accepted. <laughs> Thank you. I was the best of those sons of bitches. Yeah, I'm sure you're a little angry right now, but I mean, come on, Sam. Even you have to admit, I'm, I'm awesome. I'm sorry. But your character, so you're going to be Sister Joe. We already mm -hmm. know this. We know a few things. Yes. Um, Jared Padalecki, I don't know if you've heard of him. I sort of know him. He, I mean, he may have alluded that he wants to, like, maybe stab your character. Are you, well, how do you feel about this? Well, <laughs> I, I've, I already know what's happening, and so um, I think... Sister Joe might have the upper hand. God's back. He's pissed. And he's gonna murder the world. Unless we stop him. So you want me to be on your side? Against God? I mean, we are better looking. No. I, I know This is where I just look into your eyes and try and determine it for myself. Yeah. I don't think that's gonna happen. Stabbing? No. I think it's a retaliation for the way that his wife died on the show. Yes. Um, yeah. But it's killed, okay. You, you know why? Her, right? Because you, you, I did. You Jared held her yeah, while I, you killed her. It look. I, hey, semantics. who stabbed who? We don't know. We just we all we're all friends. We all get together, and now we can all get together and drink beer. So that's that's yeah. you know it all. Yeah. It, we, we just bring it back to the beer. <laughs> okay. If I turned out to be a demon, how would you kill me? Um, I'd probably use one of our many demon blades, yeah. or I'm sorry, angel blades, or the demon knife. Cool. Hope I got that right. I the demon that. knife? <laughs> you, yeah, people I will correct right. you if you're oh, wrong no. about that. Oh, I, um, trust me, I know. I've never been corrected on air, so it's great. Um, <laughs> anyway. I'm not going to make God my enemy, because he's God. Well, you don't have a choice. You wouldn't. Try us. I don't have it. Then who does? An old friend of yours. 
Ruby. Wait a second. Why would you give it to her? It's a long story. And she found me. Hey. Thanks for watching Wayward Winchester. Subscribe for more awesome Wayward content. Till next time, as always, no chick flick moments. Peace.